Cover the search and rescue helicopter as it picks up Delta II. Rendezvous with the squadron vehicles. Hello, this is Chesty17. So we're back to Desert Storm, uh, uh, Conflict Desert Storm 2 on the GameCube, GameCube, and we're on the level Besieged. And here we go, loading, nearly done, come on. There you go, let's go, come on, press that. So here we go, next level, good fun. So here we go. So at the start of this level, you just need to... Mortar has come, so you want to stay to the right and go through into this little courtyard or little fence place. Then go down here and use you and your men. So here we go. So you want to head in here. There's an ambush, so you can quickly come here and shoot guys' lid down. Like that. Now you want to head in here, all guns blazing, really. As you can see, we try and stay as a unit, which is decent on this game spread out too much, it's quite easy to get killed and it's good hard work to go back to heal your allies. So yeah, alright let's do that and yeah so it's all good. Yeah so this game is like amazing. Especially for co-op, like it goes up the four player. The only problem is four player gets a bit, you can't really see if you get me. So on this bit you need to kill, clear out all the rooms. Oh, anti-tanks there, you want RPG, anti-tank RPGs. Oh, dead end there. So you want to wait for this guy to catch up. There he is coming towards me on my screen, which is the left. Then you want to follow him, like so. And you want to give him a bit of a push, because he likes that. There you go. He likes that, there you go. So you want to head down here to this door with where Foley and Jones is. There you go, door open, and then you want to get an RPG out. And... Boom! There you go. And it, that's it. So you carry on, kill the gunship, you can shoot at it if you want. But I fired RPG, just, you know, save the ammo. This bit you can do silently, but... um. I decided to go for the more awesome approach. Get down! There you go. And you carry on in here. Get down again. See, duck or die. Well, if they duck, they're still going to die, so duck and die, probably more appropriate. Gonna plant a claymore. Just so, you know, if anyone does come up behind us, they should die. You know, good tactics, get owned. So on this bit, you want to just sit on the roof and cover. Alright, so the helicopter's going to land to the west, and we needed to cover anyone like the Alpha uh, the Alpha team that are planting bombs, um, planting C4 on the uh, the aerial towers. You can see them like there. See them on fairly screen now, just to the left of that now. There they are. The antennas. They're planting bombs on them, so they can't, you know, communicate to anyone. And they and they come on the roofs, as you can see. Boom. So we're just waiting for something to happen, there's nothing going on at the moment, you're waiting for Alpha 2 to come in I think. Oh no, the helicopter's coming in, there it is. They give us a lot of um, anti-tanks for a reason. Boom, sniper there, good shot by JRC. And again. And again. 
God, I just might as well just keep saying and again, and again, and yeah, so new objective. Here's the objective. We need to defend them as they come in. The first tank that comes in is on the left side where Connors is looking now. So you want to be ready because you, there it is, you can hear it coming now. RPG's out right, waiting for him. There it is. Just see it coming in now. Fire the RPG. One tank dead. Good work. Then change back to your machine gun. On the right you see um, Bradley's and Jones shooting ammo on the turrets. So it's all good at the moment. Yeah, the, the co-op on this game is ex uh, it's awesome. The only downside is the, you have to have a big TV really. Makes it like when you think about this screen, but it's like got a cut down the middle as well. And that's your screen. It's a bit more difficult. So this is where it goes a bit downhill. So Connor's just watching the tank. Fires once, didn't kill it. Then look, Bradley and Foley nearly dead. And they're all dead except for Connor's. Now Connor's trying to lock on but he's moving. There you go, kills it. So now he's got to do a bit of med uh, healing everyone. Here's Foley. Going downstairs. See, this game is hard. It's not easy. Tanks are just tanks are so gay. It's just like the worst thing in the world. Like the men are normally easy to kill. Then you get tanks and they just kill everyone. Like one hit kills you. It's pain in the ass. So now we're just getting back to our windows, shooting out. So we got rocket launchers that I'm going to give to Connors because he's an expert with them. As you can see, when you put your, when you're not the other character, they do still play as an AI, as you can hear. And another tank's coming. Making Connors go on the stairs, so if the tank does shoot us, it, like we can heal up again. It's just a little tank this time, so... Goodbye. Bit of covery fire. the helicopter then we're done that's quite an easy mission it's just a lot of defending going on it's pretty simple so now you can head out to the um, exit which is just over here and I'm getting shot quite badly get down don't shoot me bastard and you head over here you head over over here Now you're just waiting for Foley to catch up. So we're just waiting for the um, door to be blown. There you go. Now you need to run by. Run in and then that's the end. Pretty easy mission. A couple tanks. Just need to defend your base pretty much try not to stick together so the tanks don't kill you all at once so yeah that's it and there you go and the antennas are going to get blown with the C4 that they planted one down there you go
So, that's the next level. We got a medal for Bradley. No medal for <laughs> Foley. So, my two people got medals because my people are awesome. So, it's been JRC and Chazzy B17. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.